Welcome to the EFS Survey Tutorial for Beginners. This video series will show you the way to a finished survey project in 8 steps. This video covers Step 5, Inviting the Participants. After you have programmed, activated and tested your survey, you are ready to invite the participants. How to proceed with the invitation depends on the type of project. We will first take a look at an anonymous survey. For an anonymous survey project, the URL for the survey is published on a web page, in a newsletter or in social networks. Just copy the link. Or in the case of social networks, click on the corresponding buttons. Also the creation of a QR code or the integration of a pop-up window in a website is possible. Now we will invite participants to a personalized survey. Click on Import Participants in the Survey menu. As a first step, you upload your participants from an Excel or CSV file. To make it easier on yourself, click on Download Import Template. This Excel file will help you to allocate the participant data to the appropriate variables. This allocation is needed for the uniform organizing of the survey participants in the participant administration. In our case here, we need the variables you first name, you name, and you email. Now select your prepared Excel list and click on Send File. Finally, click Move on to Preview and then Import. As a next step, we will create the invitation mail. After uploading the test persons into the participant administration, you can invite them to the survey. To do this, choose the participants to be invited, select Invite, and finally click Execute. Select an email sender and formulate the invitation mail for the survey. Be sure to write the variable names between number signs so that they can serve as placeholders. In this case, for the first and last names of the survey participants. The placeholder for the survey link is code complete. Finally, go to the mail preview. Here you have the possibility to check your data one more time. Pay attention that the participants are addressed correctly and that the individual survey link has been added. Now you can send the invitations. Depending on the installation load, it might take a while for your email to be sent. For larger surveys, it would make more sense to invite in several waves, since only 100 participants can take part in a survey at one time. The next step is now to monitor the progress of the field phase. If you want to learn more, watch our next tutorial. Good luck with your project!